Good morning, ladies. Hello, doggies. Dogs are here. It is Saturday. I'm still in my gown. I don't know what time it is. It's nearly nine o'clock in the morning. I've just put a hair treatment in. I now do this treatment before I wash my hair because I am trying to, I don't know, how do I help my hair? I don't know. It has never been hair that's thick or anything. Of course, it's fine, but it breaks all the time. So I'm trying everything I can again to get it to work. So this is a Garnier Fructus Repairing Papaya Hair Food. Very cool. I love it. And my daughter loves the smell of it. It really is like paw paw or papaya. Not much left. So, and I only buy it when it's on special. I think it was around $10, which is pricey to me. So I'll look for another one today. Use three ways for damaged hair. So I just leave it in my hair for at least 20, 30 minutes before I go for a shower. And often, and I've mainly got it in the ends, but I did rub a little bit there. Hello. Um, I just leave it on for about, yeah, 20, 30 minutes, wash it out. And sometimes I find that I just don't need to do anything else. I get oily roots and dry ends. <sighs> but sometimes this just somehow cleans my hair enough. And it's fine. But today I think I need a full shampoo because I've been sweating. It's not too bad here today, actually. It's I think it's about 20 at the moment. I'm not sure what it's getting to, but it's crazy windy, unfortunately. Um, so it's a real relaxed weekend. So we're just going to plot around the house. I'm going to try and fix my pantry in the kitchen. It got out of control. I'm glad I didn't take a photo of it over Christmas because it was so full of junk. I've just finished, actually nearly finished a giant tin of biscuits my dad and his partner bought for us. Um, my friend Karen bought me a massive box of shortbread and oh my god it was so good. And there were bags and bags of chips and ugh. So I'm super glad, little dogs are here, it's getting hot in this room already though. Super glad that's all finished and now we need to really just sort it out get it organized get it back together and because school's starting in two weeks so we'll be back to patch lunches which means i also get organized more, a lot more with my food too so today <sighs> do a little bit of that um, my under the kitchen you know where the washcloth oh what are they called under the kitchen sink um, it's a little messy, it's a little crazy, and here, I think pretty much in Australia, everywhere, and being summer, it's, oh, it's a constant battle, many, many times a day, with teeny weeny little ants, I'll show them, if I haven't killed them all again, but in the bathroom, they go for the sink where the water is, um, they come through my grout, like, you wake up in the morning, and there's dirt, and they've sort of pushed all the grout, I don't know how they do it. Uh, but the bathroom and the kitchen. The kitchen is a constant. Oh, like you'll spray them and they'll all die. It doesn't matter whether you, I've tried, you know, getting rid of that straight away, cleaning, da da da, they'll be back. And then I thought, right, I'm going to leave the dead ones there with the spray for a little bit. And then bam, more walking over it. It's crazy. So I'm going to do a little bit of that, uh, killing the ants, kitchen, maybe my bathroom, that needs a bit of organising again, I think. And my daughter's outside playing, you may hear the music, dancing actually, and she was hiding, playing hide and seek with the dogs, but they're obviously too hot because they're in here, it's getting really hot in here. Colour's probably not great in here, is it the light? And I've been watching my YouTube ladies this morning. I'm just watching um, Dawn, the Minimal Mum. They've just finished the boys' room. Uh, they just bring me so much joy, those ladies. And and Tom. Sweet. And oh, Monique Parent. I hope I'm saying parent right, parent. Oh, I have missed her videos so much. And if you check her out, look at the new backdrop and count she's got going on. She's gorgeous. She's phenomenal. If you want confidence in what you're doing, think about, just watch her, watch her. She'll do what she wants and I love it, love it. 
I'm still doing, even though I got rid of my iPhone, happy days, I still apparently have 9,208 items up on the cloud. I'm paying $4.50 a month, so I, and that is it. I thought I'd moved all the photos onto my little hard drive, but apparently not. So I'm not sure what's going on. And the videos, I don't know what to do because they are not moving. Any new stuff from now on is going straight to the hard drive. I'm not using the cloud. <sighs> but it's still not everything works. No more than 100 at a time. And the videos, I don't know what to do. So my goal for this week, I'll give myself a full week, is to empty the cloud as much as possible that I don't have to pay for the extra storage because I want that off. I'm not happy about that. And then nothing, my iPad that's now gone to my daughter, that's the cloud is off. So none of those photos that she takes or videos will go to the cloud. <sighs> so that's sorted. We do actually have to go to the shops. I'm not sure if my partner's coming up today. He didn't come up last night because um, his brother's in town. And I think his sister and brother-in-law are coming up too. So I'm not sure I see him. I really need to do some gardening. What was the dog snoring? You all right, man? Oh, you're so cute. It's <laughs> a kitty lazy. Oh my god, Bibby snores. He's hilarious. Um, I do need to head out into the garden, but we'll see. Mate, it, by the time yeah. it's already nine, so by the time I'm ready, it's going to be too hot. It's really getting hot in here now. I think I'll do a face mask today too. I've got one left. It's really amazing. I will put that up because that's really hydrating. Love it. And my mum bought me. A jigsaw for Christmas it was for me and I got that out last night <laughs> and I thought oh it's gonna be a tough one because it's all sort of the same color and then Mimi, when I got it out it, I was like these are not the right colors this, what's this and it says on the back of the pack this is not the picture so it has no picture but I actually started last night and I'm surprised I was actually doing pretty well. Thank you. Thank you. So I'm going to get back to that, do a little bit of that today, catch up on my YouTube because normally on the weekends I don't get to watch my YouTube because my partner's here and he can't stand what I watch. So yes, thank you. Um, I get to do that today. I'm very excited. Dogs are going crazy because it's our junk pickup. I don't know if everyone does a junk pickup. Um... I think it's twice a year where you can pretty much just, you know, like my daughter's old bike, don't tell her, is out the front. Some old rugs, they're out the front. And people go through and pick them up before the truck comes and picks it up. Um, and I love it. I've done it myself. I've found some amazing little cupboards and things like that. <sighs> but people, if you're going to do it, don't do it at 11 o'clock at night with your little torches. Drove me insane last night, drove the dogs insane. And then they took the, my beautiful fuchsia rug, which I totally destroyed. It was covered in everything. It's been sitting outside for about three months. It just wasn't worth even trying to clean. The neighbors there over the road, their boxes flew around into my garden. Everything flows into my garden. And then, so I'd already collected their crap, put my rug in it to hold the box down. And then now these people last night took the rug, ooh, and now I see the boxes out there floating around. So I'm like, oh, why can't people think? You know, think. So strange things people have taken. The dog, the dog travel box, container, I don't know. It was pretty amazing. You get them from Kmart and BW, I think $30, $40. They're amazing. But the dogs have chewed all the zip parts. But it would make a good little... Um, I suppose like a dog kennel at home, but where you can see through. So the dogs do like it, but it had to go. It's just too much crap here. So I cannot wait for them to come. But being Saturday, I assume the truck will be coming from Monday. Mm. I'm glad I got it all out. I got a lot of crap out. Hello, darling. Um, I do need to also clean the fridge out. But my fridge, the seal has started to go. It's an old fridge. It's a 
probably third hand fridge I don't even know and <clears throat> I don't want to show you that fridge it's really quite gross so my partner's got another fridge that he's not using at the moment so we're going to bring that in here and that's quite a nice new fridge so when we bring that in I'm going to show you some of that um, I found a new lady the other day um, I feel like I'm going to get this wrong DIY Fenwick Fenwick DIY I'll put it up I'll put it up um, oh, I, she's so gorgeous um, her body her build oh, that sounds a bit creepy but her build is just gorgeous I absolutely love it and her house, oh my god, her home is just perfection. And she's amazing. She does all these amazing DIYs. What I love to do, but I'm not very good at. And going thrift shopping and finding things, all that kind of stuff. And actually, it wasn't her after all of that. But she's been doing a lot of container shopping, things like that. So that has motivated me. And it was someone else. I don't know. But they had like drink bottle storage in their fridge so when we get soft drink i don't drink soft drink normally and neither does my daughter but my partner does so when he's here on weekends the fridge is filled with soft drink and then what he doesn't drink i end up drinking not good but you can store them vertically You'll probably get three in i think which would be amazing i've never heard of that so i'm going to look for that um because that would make a big difference being able to put the drinks in like that amazing so i mean we do need to go food shopping so maybe we'll go to big w which is just near us and look for some more containers i bought four amazing containers the other day excuse me Benny. two gray two white i'll show you they were for me or around the house and they've ended up in my daughter's room because she has so much stuff it's ridiculous so Let's get on with our day. Give my hair a little longer. Once I've had a shower, then I can actually do a bit more. I just feel, eh, I need a shower and wash my hair. It's gross. Oh, everyone's excited. I'm getting up. All right, so on with the day. Start. This makes me furious doing the computer. So it's the only thing open, the iCloud. If I press on something, it goes, something's slowing the computer down. One of the programs. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Anyway, let's do it. Saturday. Hello. So I finally washed out my hair. Feels really good. Beautiful. Hello, doggies. Oh my gosh. So my daughter ended up being picked up by her dad, all the lighting. Um, they're off to a dam, I think, today to go swimming, which is really cool. So she might be back tonight, otherwise tomorrow morning. So I have a bit more time to just relax a little. I've just turned off YouTube. I've been watching, um, well, Monique, which I said before, Monique Parent, awesome. I love her. She's just, she gives me confidence. She gives me confidence. I love it. And I was watching Dawn from The Minimal Mom. That was awesome. And Clutterbug, of course, always. Uh, Catnip finally had an, another video out. Oh, I love her. But I'm usually on YouTube for, I mean, this is how I found it. It, it was for fun. But I do a lot for my business on there. I'm learning so much. So I have my notebook back here somewhere. Where are we? A little a VA bookkeeping one with one of my many inspirations on the front, my vision boards. But I decided just to relax a little. It is quite warm today. I've got some washing going, you may be able to hear that. Soon my hair will be dry, I'll look less like an odd smurf. I am going to do some jigsaw puzzle. So my mum bought me this. The Orient Express mystery, I think it's a, a mystery jigsaw puzzle, but it's got a little pamphlet book in here too. She bought herself one too, and there's quite a few to get, all mystery ones. Uh, what did mum get? Murder on the Nile, I think mum got. Now I was like, ugh, this is going to be a really difficult puzzle. Look at just all the same colours. It's going to be really tricky. As soon as I opened the packet, 
I was like, oh, this is a mix of colors. And then of course, <laughs> right here, beware the puzzle is different from the box cup. So there is no picture. Uh, now I, I live for the picture. But I've surprisingly, I just started last night, I've actually done pretty good. So I'm gonna do a bit more of that today. Watching Midsummer Murders. Uh, now this is my very last one. And I was trying to think where I got it from. I either got, this is my face mask that I'm going to put on. Amazing for hydration. So I am going to buy some more. It was either TVSN, but I am thinking it was Open Shop actually. And I believe I bought like a 20 pack and it was a really good price. But I thought with my sensitive skin, I should try it first. I have a feeling they had 50 and 100 packs. Uh, and I will be doing that next. It is so hydrating. And it's one of those kind of creepy sheet masks that you put on. So I won't show you with, you know, my face all creepy like. Creeps my daughter out, creeps the dogs out. So I put that on, I leave it on for 20 minutes, about that, 20, 30 minutes. I will, there's always so much, it's so wet, you think, oh my gosh, but it just sits beautifully on your face. I'm gonna lie back a little, listen to my show. And at the end, there's always more. There's always more there. I usually rub it all over my arms and my legs. I just dab it into my face and I leave it. I leave it for the day and because it's Saturday, I am meant to be food shopping, but I don't know if I will, but that's what I'm doing. Can hear the washing machine's nearly finished. I've got the dishes in the sink. I still haven't steam mopped. I've got to do that. But that's it for now. That's what I'm doing. I feel I've got my little badge up. I'm very annoyed that you can see my bra under that. But anyway, we'll fix that. Oh, and I'm still downloading photos from the cloud. Of course I am. I am still at 9,700, I think. Awesome. See you soon. ended up I did everything I wanted to really um, I didn't clean out the pantry I didn't garden what else didn't I do oh I didn't steam mop but I ended up doing that this morning so I've done a quick food shop steam mop the house uh, my partner's coming down for a few hours today which would be lovely oh sorry stepped on the dog sorry buddy sorry and that's about it I'm super tired today I had a terrible sleep again. I'm not sure if it's the weather, sleeping on the couch all the time. I don't know, because that's where the aircon is. Um, so I don't know, I really need a nap. It's 11.30 in the morning and I'm going for a nap very soon. I had a beautiful omelette for my first meal of the day along, uh, I think I've had one and a half liters of water. So everything else is good. It's just I haven't had enough sleep. Now, yesterday I was talking about ants and the tiny little ants we're getting. And oh my gosh, I was at the shops this morning and this lady walked past me and she was flicking an ant off herself. And we had this massive conversation about how horrendous her ants are in the kitchen. And I'm like, me too. <sighs> so we're both going to try bicarb and we're both going to try baby powder. But... They do just keep coming back. So anyway, my little monkey's home. We are a little bit rearranging the house today, but that's it. I need to relax. We'll do a good food shop tomorrow. Maybe a trip to the beach. We'll see how we go. It's warm, but not too hot. But pretty much that's my weekend wrapped up, done. 
So I hope you've all had a great weekend or maybe you're going into the weekend. Let me know what you're up to. Let me know who you're watching, who's inspiring you, because I need to know. Otherwise, that's it. I've had a lovely weekend. So I will see you Friday for, I don't know what I'm doing this Friday for my sort of life coaching, a bit more serious business thoughts. We'll see. But I'll see you then. Bye.